harvesting my garlic so I'm going to make some salmon luau or palasami and put some lemon to it. It's messy. Hello everyone, so today we're going to make a uh, Samuan Luau of Palosami. So all we needed is uh, tar leaves and some coconut cream and I'm going to put some meat into it. So I'm going to show you uh, what are the ingredients that I've used. So I harvested some of my tar leaves, they're really nice from my garden, look at that. I got heaps of them and harvested and we're going to make a salmon loa. Salmon loa is made up of mainly taro leaves and coconut cream and bake it and you can put some meat if you like so today I'm going to mix it with uh, some lamb uh, um, you can also use pork if you want that but it's up to you what you want so all you have to do is you have a coconut cream so we don't have fresh coconut cream here in New Zealand but you can use the kara kara is the best for my luau and then it depends how, how many you are making so I have some two onions that we're going to dice and I have some of my pieces of lamb which is I already boiled a little bit because it takes a while to cook the, the lamb and so that's why I dice them so and some salt and of course you need a foil to wrap it around so let's just keep going So all we have to do is not to mix it with the meat and then mix with the coconut cream So we can taste them if it's salty. that they are folded properly so it doesn't leak then let's get the
so it's just mainly like depends with the size of your taro leaves maybe three to three big leaves and two small ones so I get three leaves and then I mix with some spinach leaves to make it moist Okay, so once it's preheated, we put in the baking tray with water and then just put some try some top on it and just put sugar. By now, my oven is already preheated. Here you go. Yeah. Nice, and then go to the oven. Let's go. So let's see. 